Hi guys, I'm just making this video um, because I said that I was going to dye this wig to try to get it to match my hair and um, I was going to wait two weeks to do it but I was impatient and I went ahead and dyed my hair to make it match the wig. Um, my hair was originally um, like an orangey brown color and so I dyed it with a light ash brown by Revlon to um like get rid of the brassy tones and now my hair is so dark and I don't know how I feel about it um I haven't had dark hair in forever like I miss my my orangey my orange hair but um it actually matches like almost perfect well I mean it's still kind of wet so it's darker than what it would be and it's also it gets lighter whenever I sh flat iron it but now my hair has that weird greeny I guess that's the ash color I guess that's what color this is this is, must be like an ash brown or something but um yeah but like see like in different lights depending on the angle and the lighting it looks like gold green or something my hair I don't know what color it is now but I want it to be the orange color again. But, I mean, I guess I'll just keep washing it until this color kind of fades off. Or, um, I'm thinking about getting some of that sun-in stuff that you can spray on your hair to kind of lighten it just a little bit. Because, I mean, I I mean, I knew it would take out the orange color, but I didn't realize that it would make my hair so dark. And, I mean, I don't think it looks bad. I just can't. It'll just take me a while to get used to it. But... Yeah, um, I'm probably just going to wear my natural hair the next couple of days and, you know, to give it a break because this, um, cap has clips in it and, you know, I don't, I'm not going to say it pulls your hair, but, I mean, I kind of just want to give my roots a break from, you know, the clips, like, digging in it, so... Yeah, and then um, I'll flat iron the front of my hair again and um, come back on and show you guys how well it matches or not. But yeah, that's just my update.